In this video, I'm going to show the power of workflow automation using the Connect Module feature in the paid version of Fiery Jobflow. We're building a custom scratcher raffle ticket. We will be adding the numbers and also a customized random back to the file. And finally, generating a coding file as well, all using Fiery Jobflow. The Fiery Jobflow Connect module enables the use of third-party pre-pressed solutions such as ImageMagick for job processing via custom scripts or hot folders. This workflow uses a one-up, one-sided ticket as input, as you can see here. It has a numbering, if you look in the file name, the numbering start, the quantity defined in the file name of the job. If I click on the Fiery Jobflow workflow, you can see here we use a few connect modules as well as an in-focus action and an impose template to create the job. We're using a connect module to get quantity from the PDF and duplicate. We're numbering the PDF. We're reversing the page order. We're collating the job with a variable back. We're applying a Duplo style gang up reorder. We're also separating the job and the coding plate for the job, sending it to another workflow. We are also imposing the job and then finally adding a barcode to the job for a digital coder. Then we output to a Fiery DFE with a server preset set for the EFI ticket. If I take the Fiery Scratcher ticket file and drop it on the job flow workflow, it will start processing the file. And if we go to the jobs queue in job flow, we can see the file being processed. You will see that the file is broken into two. The coding file is being created as well as the output file for the Fiery DFE. Let's take a look at the files that have been created. First, let's take a look at the file that has been created for the Fiery DFE. If I click on job, it will open the job. I can see a preview of the job and I can see that barcodes have been added for both the digital coding device and the digital trimming device as well as a registration mark. I can also see that my tickets have been laid out in lanes and the numbering that has been added by job flow in the white space at the bottom of the front of the ticket is incrementing in reverse order and it goes up in the lane again for the digital trimming device that will be used at the end of the uh, workflow. As we go down we can see that the tickets have their variable back merged to them automatically by job flow and all the pages have been created in order. Next let's take a look at the coding plate that has been created. The coding plate will have a blank first page as there's no coding on the first page of the job. The second page will have the coding laid out as it should be for our two-sided raffle ticket. And finally, let's take a look at the job on the Fiery DFE. If we go to Command Workstation, we can see the job has been received from job flow and that on the right-hand side that the media has been assigned to the job using our EFI server preset, quantity of pages is correct, and the number of copies is correct. So the job is ready to print. This workflow shows you the power of automation in Fiery Jobflow using the Connect module. Thank you and have a good day.